What's going on guys? So I am going to do a site install on my Smith & Wesson 686 um, and I'm going to do it the poor man way. I don't have all the proper equipment and all that crap and I'm not going to spend $30 on or $20 on a punch. So I bought some number 54 punches which is the size that you need for the Smith & Wesson 686 and I took one of the punches and uh, took some bolt cutters to it and just snipped it, some small bolt cutters and just snipped it off. That way I can uh, use this as a punch. You know? So I got this pack of shims that I'm gonna use to support it while I punch out that pin, but also I'm gonna use these on the vice block so I don't mar up my Smith & Wesson. All righty, so we got the pin out. Now I don't care about this front side, as you can see I already destroyed it, messing with it. Because I was trying to scrape off the paint and uh, I didn't realize that this was just like a big chunk of clay in there and that, there, that it wasn't just painted over a metal site, there's actually a chunk of clay that goes in there. So I went ahead and uh, while I was trying to scrape off the, or just scrape away the top layer of paint, I ended up doing more than I expected. All right, so that's out, nice and easy. So we got the Dawson Precision front sight that I'm putting on. Let's see how this fits. Oh, it fits right in. So I need that to be a little bit more flush. Why am I using the metal side? Don't 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 use the metal side like me. I'm a dumbass and I didn't think about that. Alright, so now we're gonna go ahead and drill a hole. Now what I did was I put some blue Loctite into the channel and then put the front sight in there. That way it would uh, kind of adhere into there. That way I wouldn't have to use clamps and all that crap. Um, so what I'm gonna try to do, I've never done this before and I hope I don't mess up my revolver. Is I'm gonna try to drill halfway through from each side. That way I could create the hole. Now I gotta make sure this is perfectly level. So far it looks good. Let's go and put that pin back in. Grab our punch and seat it in. So I think I'm going to go ahead and swap this out for the green fiber optic front sight because I just like the green better. 